I going on quirky? Yes, I am. How's my treaty integrity? Eh. Eh. Still good enough. Actually, after this, I have one more war that must be fought. Okay. Turkey. They took their capital. I mean, what bad things will happen to me declaring war on a NATO member? Hmm. Uh, they're not they're in not NATO. NATO. Oh. Oh, that's right. They don't join till later. Cubans Egg. spying on me. Damn Cubans. Damn you and your cigars. They took their capital. Oh, for fuck's sake, come on. Have you ever tried a Cuban cigar? I've nope. had a Cuban cigar. I don't smoke. Me neither, but I still want to try it. Oh, dude, it's so good. I don't smoke either, but, like, it's so good. Also, Saudi Arabia's dead. Yeah, Saudi Arabia's dead. And I'm on. I mean, woo! Saudi Arabia's dead! Yeah, good job, Shibia! Such a major accomplishment for the play that we did it! Yeah! Yay! Oh, <laughs> 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 Yeah, they And Israel grew 10 sizes that day. <laughs> oh no, I have an election coming up. Oh no, well, whatever will I do? The only reason Muscat's still alive is because there's no supply to get to that final town. <laughs> And you have no supply trying to get to Yemen's capital. <laughs> Boy, they. Bastards don't even have a port. Yep. I see the Indians have Iowas in that region. Just have a lot of Iowas in general. Only Iowas, practically. Apparently. They took their capital. I did finally end up getting a new tank. That's Yay. not World War Two or otherwise garbage. It's the TL two Raptor. I will never finish improved power grid. Yay! <laughs> Before this is over. <laughs> but at least we got to test out this little scenario a bit. I'm pretty happy with it. I think it'll make for some interesting future PvPs for sure. Yeah. And there goes North Yemen. Now... That one thing that you just can't get to the capital of. Quick, who has supply planes? 
Oh, they have a they have a garrison there. If that recon actually makes it, that recon's gonna die. India, move your Iowas there. <laughs> you literally came to me to buy the TL2 Raptor design, even <laughs> though, like, the playthrough's gonna be over in like, like no time. You still needed the TL2 Raptor. I need everything. Also, this is a lot more than just sending your Iowas. You just click, dragged, and narrowed it down to naval yep. units and then sent everything. Well, yeah, you, there there they go. They're you do know the, I'm, the I, can, I can move through the British colony, right? <laughs> There's little to no supply in there, though, so uh, try not to send too many or you're just going to get stuck. At least some of them have made it to the final town. Hopefully they're enough. And you have entered the lands. And you're out of fuel immediately. <laughs> yeah, you're just out of fuel immediately. <laughs> Get the supply planes! I don't have any! <laughs> oh man, well, I guess... Muscat won the game, man. They won the whole game. Oh, we're getting a little farther. That supply spilling over from Yemen. You're sending too many troops. That supply is not going to push all the way if they catch up. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> ah, ah, ah. ah, you asked for that. <laughs> That's so funny, man. Hey, but you took the capital. And now you just have a bunch of units stuck in uh, the Aiden Protectorate and Muscat and these parts of Saudi Arabia that have zero supply. And now the Turks are invading you just like you wanted. Yeah, I'll hold them back. I also want to speed this up. <laughs> Oh, there's another capital now. Muscat. I'm getting closer to that 20% inflation again. So a lot of what I'm building is finishing. So I'm gonna build more. Think you can do it alone, Shibby, Turkey? Yeah, I'm good. Another capital for Muscat. Air France, give me some Air Force. Sudan achieved independence. That's the most important thing we're going to see. Oh, yeah, for real.
Italy and Laos made an alliance. That's important. All right, let's see what we got here. Play everything. Now they're making you fight for it. Only a little bit. My Air Force bombing the shit out of them, too. Man, those Turks have some pretty advanced tanks. Yeah, they have the same things as you Oh, the see. AMX. Yeah. Frenchy tanks. Yeah, I didn't know the AI bot designs. Me neither. <laughs> I guess in this one they do. Yeah, I guess so. And now there's just like a bunch of infantry. What are you laughing about? Well, I guess after this, that's going to be the end of it. I've achieved my goal. That was the last one on the list was Turkey. Let's see here. I also saw some IS-6s on ter this territory. Alright, there we go. Keep hitting them with their strikes. Something. What's that? <laughs> <laughs> Those ISXs and everything, I sent them to Turkey. I'm sure you did. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, they're still getting their asses kicked. 
Yeah, I send their own 60 or something. See here, there's heavy concentration of troops right here. Let's get an airstrike on there. And just about ready to hit their capital. Yeah, it's almost over. Are you going to keep sending shit to Turkey that I can blow up? <laughs> no, no, I, I, I only send a few troops, nothing much. I was wondering if you noticed that. This has all the sass of our PVPs. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty <Yeah>. much. <laughs> well, at least from Shibi. It's got all the sass from Shibi. Narfi's just giggling like a schoolgirl. <laughs> and Kara The Israelis have come for you. Damn, my air force just obliterated them. New capital, Istanbul, but which one? Ah, oh, they're dead. It doesn't matter, hey, they're dead. The Straits is a new country. <laughs> it's literally just called Straits. Nice. Alright, so is that... Oh, you fucker. <laughs> he didn't give a shit about the implications of that he's like oh i'm just gonna attack them too leave no stone unturned finish the job it has a turkish flag it must die <laughs> Man, you just stormed in there. <laughs> There's just no competition. Yeah, they're dead. <laughs> Alright, are we good? Alright, I think we're good. Are we good? Unless, unless anyone wants to do anything else. We good. Okay, that was a fun little co-op. We tested out this scenario. We had some shenanigans, lots of banter. I don't think this is going to be like any more than 10 episodes. But it was a fun <laughs> little time. We got a nice little playthrough out of it. Yeah. Japan rose from the ashes, conquered half of China. India became a military power, conquered half of China. Israel owns the Middle East. Uh, there you go. Cool. Mission accomplished. <laughs> Next SRU series will probably just be a PvP. <laughs> well, the rest of them probably will be. I do. You don't have nukes. You don't have nukes <laughs> to launch. You don't, you just hit the button at the end of every playthrough. You just you motherfucker. Hey, this the time you actually like hit the button right because you're only at war with with the one person. I didn't launch any nukes. I just declared war. Oh, who the hell? Launch the nukes then. I don't think. I think. Nobody. I guess they did against me. Oh, it was you. Know. It was India against me. That's what it was. Oh, I didn't launch nuke at this level. Walk. Mmm. All right. Well, <laughs> I'm cracking. <laughs> he just left. <laughs> <laughs>